There is definitely something to see at the Vancouver Aquarium. Cece, the giant Pacific octopus, is laying her eggs after mating several months ago with another octopus named Clove. In this case, because the male and the female are in a, an aquarium setting where they you know, don't have the ability to move too far, we noticed that there were multiple uh, coupling activities um, where the male and the female male would mount the female. I think it was 11 times that, we, that uh, they were noticed together. In this case, um, after a number of months, uh, the male naturally died on display, um, which is um, something that, that maybe they naturally do in, in the wild after, after mating. Cece is hiding right now as she lays her eggs. Female octopi are dedicated mothers. They stop eating and spend the rest of their lives watching over their eggs until they hatch. Uh, they are terminal spawners, so when, they, when they, the eggs are um, you know, hatched, uh, they, they will die. There's a good chance of that, a, that some of those will be uh, you know, predated on by other fish and other animals in there. Um, there is a chance that we, that we may try and um, propagate a few of the eggs um, in our, uh, in our uh, research lab, but uh, the majority of the eggs will uh, just na ha naturally hatch out in the exhibit. Um, we'll have to wait and uh, divers will, will be entering the exhibit on a regular basis to uh, observe the development. For the octopus, mating marks the beginning of the end of a life cycle, but there is still another one on display and perhaps it will be joined in the future by a few baby octopi as well. Alwena Shirley in Vancouver for BCIT Magazine.